Under the Copyright Act, a wronged copyright owner can elect to recover statutory damages instead of actual damages. Generally speaking, the amount of statutory damages is between $500 and $20,000 for each act of copyright infringement. But is there a constitutional right to a jury trial on the amount of statutory damages in copyright cases? The United States Supreme Court addressed this question in the 1998 case of Feltner v. Columbia Pictures Television. C. Elvin Feltner was the founder of Krypton International, which eventually purchased three television stations in the southeastern United States. Subsequently, the stations stopped making their royalty payments to Columbia Pictures Television, from which they had licensed several television programs. When negotiations for restructuring the station's debt collapsed, Columbia terminated their copyright licenses. Termination of their licenses notwithstanding, the stations continued broadcasting the television programs. Columbia sued Feltner for copyright infringement in federal district court. After winning partial summary judgment on liability, Columbia elected to recover statutory damages under the Copyright Act. Feltner requested a jury trial on the amount of statutory damages, but the district court denied his request and awarded $20,000 to Columbia for each act of infringement. This resulted in a total award of $8.8 million. On appeal, the Ninth Circuit affirmed the award rejecting the Seventh Amendment argument that Feltner was entitled to a jury trial on the amount of statutory damages. Feltner appealed to the United States Supreme Court, which granted cert.